<coughs> I would imagine there was a little soul searching at the half of this one. Oh, I mean, again, it was, uh, we definitely had some things we had to correct. Uh, made some errors and uh, stuff, you know, that just hurt, hurt you. I mean, you can't expect that. But, you know, we knew that they were going to come out fighting and, and uh, give them credit and, and their preparation, of course. And, uh, but again, I was I was very proud of how we responded from some of those miscues in the first half. So. Was there actually anger at halftime? That's how Coach even described it. Yeah, I mean, it, well, we were definitely, you know, I, it's one of those things, as a player, you can't get too up or down. I mean, obviously, when things are going good, you still have to you know, just keep plugging along. When things are, you know, going bad, it's the same thing. You can take yourself out of the game from trying to get back in the game. And so it's, you know, there's definitely a level of frustration, and we knew we, we left some plays out there. Uh, you know, just did some things we can't we can't do. But boy, the rhythm of the game, and you got into it in the third quarter, and then it just became a self-perpetuating prophecy, didn't it? That's a lot of big words. <laughs> <laughs> Contemplate that. That's it. <laughs> well, again, uh, you know, our defense was able to force some turnovers, yeah. give us some short fields, and uh, again, I, I think we just settled down. I mean, it was a, uh, it was a, di like I say, every game is just different. I mean, you know, we first half have eight minutes of possession time. Uh, you know, I don't even know the, I don't know the exact play count, but it wasn't high at all. Uh, you know, things of that nature. It's, it's just uh, every game has its own unique identity, and we were finally able to settle in again. I was very proud of just the whole team and all facets. Um, you know, coming out and playing better in the second half. Talk about what was going through your minds after that last play of the half when you failed to get into the end zone. I imagine it wasn't good. Yeah, it was just it was just frustrating. I mean, you know, we uh, had a chance. Thought I could make it, and it just came up a little short. Did that fuel the offense? Do you feel like at halftime, to you know, you fail to get in the end zone there, really want to establish a rhythm in the second half? Uh, I mean, I, I think it fueled all of us. But again, you know, we just, we just had to keep playing. Coach tells us all the time, you know, we just have to keep playing, keep playing. Sometimes good things are going to happen. Sometimes bad things are going to happen. You just got to keep at it because eventually things. Uh, if you do that, if you keep if you keep just hanging in there, things are going to go okay. And you know that because again, you know, you can't get too frustrated because that'll make it even. Uh, you already compound a problem and make it worse. So it's a balance. But again, we're, we're able to come out and get it done. Aren't games like this almost a coach's dream, though? You win big, you're five and zero, oh, you're ranked seventh in the country, but there are plenty of teaching moments for this week at practice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that's, uh, I think it's, I didn't really look at it that way. I think. Um, I think, in, like I said, every game has its own unique identity and has its own things that you can take away. Uh, and you know we can put in our pocket, um, you know, moving forward. And like you said, we're able to learn and, and take those tools and lessons with a win. And uh, like I said, we responded to adversity. Uh, like I said, we knew they were going to come out and you know punch us in the mouth. And uh, but again, you know, we just got to hang in there and kept keep doing what we were doing, and uh, it worked. What's the best part about beating a rival? As soundly as you guys did there. Man, again, it's it's a very good win. Uh, we just, again, it's about just what Coach always says, it's trying to get better. And, you know, we did some things that, in some areas that we didn't improve on from where we were. But again, we responded to some adversity and, and some things when they weren't going our way and when we weren't executing that we were almost still hanging there, hang tough together and get it done. So, uh, again, it was, uh, we got it done. K-State now a quick strike offense and they had eight <laughs> touchdowns and it's the longest drive of six plays. Oh my mm -hmm. goodness, I don't even know. That's a great question. It's, uh, it's again, like I said, each game just takes on its its own unique piece. And you know, we we even left some plays out there that maybe could have made that stat even you know more drastic. But the, the thing is, we just got to keep playing, keep trying to get ourselves better, and and it's it's a very good step, but it is just another step. So. Well,